hey, man, Nintendo really been out there lately, making uh, making friends with the uh, developers of fighting games. I mean, <laughs> first you had, you know, a couple months ago they announced the Marvel's Capcom collection on a Nintendo Direct. You know, first 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 official announcement from for for that game came out on a Nintendo Direct. And then a few days ago, the Marvel's Capcom 2 collection not Marvel's Capcom 2 collection, sorry. The uh the Capcom Funny collection with like the Capcom vs SNK games and all those, that got announced officially on a Nintendo Direct. Yeah, the websites came the yeah, the, the official websites and YouTube channels put out the official trailer afterwards, but the first announcement the first announcement was on a Nintendo Direct, which is like, how does that happen twice in one year? I do not know. Within the span of not even six months, I don't think, it's like they announced two, those two releases, and today we get a announcement trailer for a Guilty... Is this from Nintendo? Well, Arc System works, but anyway. And I guess this wasn't... They didn't do this during the Direct, but they've announced that Guilty Gear Strive is also coming to Nintendo Switch. There hasn't been a Guilty Gear game on... As far as I know, if I'm missing something, let me know. But as far as I know, the only Guilty Gear game... There's only one Guilty Gear game out for a Nintendo platform, and it's a Guilty Gear game on the Wii. The name escapes me at the moment. I do own the game. I actually did buy it for the Wii when it came out, but I don't remember the full title, but I know it was a Guilty Gear game. But, yeah, ever since then, I don't think there's really been a Guilty Gear game on a Nintendo system. You know, the Wii came and went. No Guilty Gear. As far as I know, there's no 3DS version. Maybe there is, and I just missed it, but uh, I don't know. But, yeah. And there's all these other Guilty Gear games that have come out in the past couple of years that there's Zerg and there's stuff like that, and none of those have come to Nintendo. But here we are with Guilty Gear Strive now coming out for the Switch. And it's so weird that these games are coming out towards the end of the Switch lifespan, which, you know, they're going to make an... Like, Nintendo said they're going to make an official announcement for Switch 2 sometime next year. So I'm guessing that it's going to be backwards compatible at this point if you've still got games coming out for it into 2025. But I'm, I'm thinking, like, 2026 is when we're finally going to see a Switch 2 out for out on the market, but who knows. But, yeah, all of a sudden, like, all these fighting games are just suddenly getting announced for the Switch, and, like, that's kind of coming out of nowhere, because, you know, Nintendo Switch has been around for seven, almost eight years now, and not real lot of fighting games on that thing. I'm sure there's some. I mean, Mortal Kombat came out, and that's about it. Outside of that, all the other games... It's, it's just a weird timeline that Games are getting it. Fighting games are getting announced for the Switch, but not that. Actually, no. This game is on Xbox. So I'm not gonna say the game's not. I, actually, I think you can even get Strive off of Xbox Game Pass, or you could. I don't know if that. I don't know if they uh, finally like took that off. But yeah, didn't think I'd see Nintendo get a, another Guilty Gear game, at least on the Switch. But this has me thinking. I'm starting to wonder if, like, when the Switch Two does come out. I'm starting to think there's a good chance we will see Street Fighter 6 and Tekken 8 on the Switch too. I don't think they're coming to the normal Switch. I don't. I think that ship has sailed. But you know, once the Switch 2 comes out, I think it might get, might be game on. So you you'll get to see Street Fighter 6 and and Tekken 8. They're gonna make their way to to the next Switch, next Nintendo system, which will probably be Switch 2, whatever they want to call it. But yeah, wow. Um, psh, I don't know what to say. The only problem I had with Strive, and I like I said, I bought Strive on PC. I don't know if it's going to make any difference for, but like getting online matches just was a pain. But maybe that's a PC version problem. I don't know, but we'll see. I definitely recommend this game. Hell, I might pick it up myself. It's going to come with like the extra, you know, it's going to come with like the extra seasons attached to it. So who knows? Maybe I will pick up the Switch version. We'll see, but anyway, yeah. I just think it's odd we're getting all these like Switch games getting announced for the 
I mean, all these fighting games came out for Switch, like, out of nowhere. Like, you'd think the Switch is winding down as well it should be, but, damn, they're still finding ways to get a couple of more bangers out before before they're done, so. Yay! 